Yo, what's going on guys? It's the Tempered Wolf and today I'm bringing you guys a gameplay of actually some Star Wars Battlefront. Now, I wanted to bring you guys this gameplay because I just got this game. I heard a lot about it. There's, uh, it, I believe it was at E3 and everything. And it, it had a really like, peep, it was really amped up pretty much for the game because it was made by EA and DICE. So basically, you know, as we all know, those are the Battlefield games. Uh, makers and it actually looks a lot like Battlefield in my opinion, but we were expecting a lot out of this game and I think I, they uh, Pulled through with this one because I really enjoyed the, I really enjoyed playing this game And this is some multiplayer gameplay and in case you guys didn't know Or just so you do know before you go out and buy the game This is a multiplayer only game So don't if you're looking for a campaign and storyline because you're more of like a Star Wars buff and you like all the Star Wars stuff it's not there's no campaign at all there's just like there's multiplayer and then you can do these side missions but now into the gameplay this is like the b basic blaster rifle that you get at the beginning when you start off because you do have ranks but I, I don't know how far you can go up in the ranks because I haven't played this game that much but as a review if I did a review for you guys on this game definitely worth a buy I would definitely go out and buy this but if you're not really a Star Wars fan or anything it and you're more of like and you don't really like playing Star Wars or even watching Star Wars I wouldn't buy this game in my opinion because you really have to understand Star Star Wars and play the past battlefronts to actually really get this game and I did and I really like it because I really did like the battlefronts before this one but it was also very easy for me to start playing and get the hang of it because of Call of Duty it has similar play style to Call of Duty or it's more of a battlefield like I said it's it's more like big map like battlefield but if if you play Call of Duty on a regular basis it is really not that hard to get used to this game just just like any other FPS and actually you can go in third person and first person so but this game was a really really good game I really would suggest that you guys go out and buy it because I the th part I like about it that's different than Call of Duty is it's a lot harder to die so you actually have to hit people so it like actually will like take a while like a little bit for you to actually kill the person because in Call of Duty as we all know it takes like three shots and then the person's dead which is like completely bull crap and it's like one shot to the head which I, that's the part I don't like about Call of Duty but in this game you really have to hit them and you, you also like I said you rank up and get different blaster pistols and that's basically blaster pistols blaster rifles and that's basically how you progress in the game and it's kind of like Call of Duty and like Battlefield in a sense as if, if you're higher rank or level you'll get better guns and more customization options so that's something also to consider and if you if you don't like Star Wars I would recommend I wouldn't recommend that you get this and there's only a few map like there's not that many maps and uh, I'm actually playing the mode called blast which is like a team deathmatch kind of style but there's not that many maps there's a few, there's a, a good amount but not that much as you'd expect so thank you guys so much for watching this video hope you guys enjoyed this if you guys want to see more Star Wars Battlefront just leave a comment below telling me so and thanks for watching I'm out Peace.